All right, guys, we're going to be solving another question from the second chapter of the Miriam textbook in Geo Mechanics. And in this one, to satisfy design limitations, it's necessary to determine the effect of the two kilonewton tension in the cable on the shear tension and bending of the fixed I beam. And the question is asking to replace this force, two kilonewton, that we have by its equivalent of two forces at point A. One of them is FT which will be parallel to the beam. So if we draw a line parallel to the beam and one, uh, so the component of the force, we're going to call it FT and the one perpendicular to the beam, you can show it with this dotted line. I'd ask us to call that one FN. So one normal to the beam and one parallel to the beam. And Pretty much the question is asking to find these two components. In other words, we just need to resolve this force into these two components. So for that, obviously, we need either this angle or this one right here. But if we look at the question, we'll see that we have this angle in here, 30 degrees, which would be same as this angle here, 30 degrees. And we have the angle between our horizontal and 2 kilonewton, 20 so basically, the angle that we are dealing with is this angle here, which would be 30 plus 20 or 50 degrees. So now it's pretty easy because our FD in here, if we look at this right triangle that I'm highlighting in yellow, this right triangle. Our FD would be the adjacent to the 50 degrees angle. So FD would be simply f times cosine of 50 degrees and our fn would be the opposite or f times sine of 50 degrees so all we need to do is just to calculate these two our f is 2 times cosine of 50 let's see what we get 2 times cosine of 50 that's going to give us 1.29 kilonewtons and 2 sine of 50 is going to give us 1.53 kilonewtons. So yeah, that's going to be our two components of FN and FD for this question. Hope everything was clear. Let me know if you guys have any questions and you guys take care. I'll see you in the next video. Have a good one.